it's a British Legion uh, update for Tuesday. Uh, it's quite late in the afternoon. My camera's just sunk a bit. And then, no, it's all right now. Yeah, quarter past four, first Tuesday afternoon. And um, I've just finished doing my Beast Men. So this will be the end of uh, the Beast Men. Because uh, all done, I'll show you in a minute how they've come out. Um, pretty pleased how they've come out. Um, thanks for all the comments on that last video. Um, sun, on that Sunday night, I just wanted to do a video so I had to bore you with um, lots of old photos I found on the computer but um, I'll try not to do that too many times because uh, well, I don't know it's nice to sort of see fresh things but um, so I'll show you in a minute but first of all I've got a little I've got some news for you I went into my local shop even though I, I am in a shop I went round to the around the corner there's this chap called um, Steve and he runs a collectible collectible toy shop but he's got into a lot of board games lately and um, a lot of board games like fantasy flight stuff proper board games and uh, I found this board game in his shop and it's second hand and uh, his mum runs a shop as well and I asked her how much it was and she said I don't know because um, it could be a lot of money and Steve's looking into it so I thought mm, oh well never mind Sorry, it's my Farmville telling me that my sheep need shearing. But anyway, um, so I went back uh, at the weekend and Steve was in the shop. And I said, how much for that uh, ball game over there? And he went, 20 quid. I went, really? Uh, you went, 20 quid. So this is what it was. Love bowl. I couldn't believe it. 20 quid. He said, well, all the components aren't really there. But anyway, I opened it up. And basically, the long and the short of it is... There's quite a lot there. Uh, I think it's 12 per squad, but uh, I spoke to Ringo and he said about 16 per squad. So I've got 12 orgs, 12 human players, no, 14 humans, 14 orgs, 14 elves. I've got four, a few dwarves as well, but not many. So I thought, wow, what a bargain, 20 quid. So I snacked it up. Uh, Ringo's not too happy, but never mind. So I've been teasing him all day. Look at look at the shiny. Look at the shiny things. <laughs> anyway, I got that. And uh, there's a few that are painted, a few that aren't painted, or quite a few that aren't painted. So I've managed to um, put some in Dettol. <clears throat> and I've got some balls. I'll show you the balls in a minute. So Yeah, I'm really pleased. So uh, you'll see some blood bowl coming from me soon. All right? So I'll just show you what in detail what I've been doing. Hang on in. Right, so here's the pitch, and um, it's the AstroTurf one, and uh, I think I'm going to repaint it. A lot of you probably think, oh no, don't do that, but um, I personally think it's going to look really cool if I paint it all like turf colour instead of asteroid colour. See, look, he's painted stuff on it, and I'm going to overpaint it all. So yeah, what I'm going to do is like paint it all um, like a, a turf colour, and then in all the recesses, I'm going to flock it in green. So once it's all done, I think it'll look pretty cool. So, uh, And I'll probably put it on plywood to reinforce it, because uh, I've been told it breaks quite easily, being um, foam stuff. So yeah, that's the board. And over here is a few of the figures. So I've got quite a few orgs. So yeah, they're all, uh, and I'm not going to be able to strip that off, I'll just paint over it. So. Yep, and I've got the elves. So yeah, not too shabby. And also some humans. As I say, the rest of them are all in the Dettel. They're not bad sculpts, but um, I'll say if they ever, ever redo it, I think they'd do, they'd do some awesome sculpts, wouldn't they? So I've got some balls over here. Where are they? Here they are. Some balls. I have painted a couple, but they're a bit tricky to paint because you can't really hold them. And obviously on that glue tech underneath, it's plastic as well. So I've got to somehow turn them over and put and re and paint them again. Okay, so that's about me done. Uh, lots of rings and stuff, uh, and over here, move these out of the way, the stack cars, the rulers, the scatter markers, 
you know, bits and bobs. I thought that was a good price for 20 quid, but um, yeah, it's a second, second edition, so. Alright, that's it. I'm out.